See the world really needs all the people like me. See how bad it <laughs> Yo, what's happening, YouTube Jugger here? Welcome back to a very special video. Before I start this video, I just want to give a shout out to my channel members. Shout out to Janelle and Summon Wolf. Appreciate you guys. Okay. So a lot of stuff is happening in the Call of Duty mobile community. And I wanted to let you guys know the truth and give you guys the rundown on what it is. The implementation and how we can make it better moving forward for Call of Duty Mobile and its players and talk about this pay to win system and how we can actually get better and what it is. So today we're talking about the discussion and the topic of the mythic weapons. So first and foremost, let's digest what mythic weapons are. Dissect it. So in this game, there's two different types of weapons that you guys can take further than the base weapons in this game and the first tier is called legendary now there's 115 legendary items in this game all it does it's a skin that gives you the ability to have a very beautiful weapon that looks visually stunning and also gives you a highlighted kill feed when you get kills within the game so that your name stands out so people know who you are that's about as far as it goes for a legendary item now these legendary items are priced by the way everything and i'm speaking about in this video is priced in usd united states dollars okay this game is based on whatever region you're located in wherever you created your account this account that i have here is my secondary account this is not my american account okay um, just so you guys know, so everything that you will be seeing here will be discounted in on this account, okay? My American account is what I'm speaking about and everything in the American region. So you guys know what I'm talking about. So when you see what you see here, just know that it's discounted because this is not an American account. This is an overseas account that I have so I can actually get discounts on my items so I can bring it to you guys. They're still super expensive. But not as expensive as the American based on um, Call of Duty mobile accounts. So for this right here, this legendary PPSH, it goes for $55 on my account. But for the American accounts to do the full draw in this game, it costs about $125 to $150 per legendary item if you guys would like something nice visually stunning weapon in this game and again there's 115 of these legendary items in the game you know what i mean there's just so many of them and they're actually beautiful and people love legendaries but me personally i do not collect legendaries i collect what they're called mythic items now these mythic items are super expensive okay and a lot of people say they're pay to win um, it's actually another skin, but it's up from a legendary and they're called mythic items and there's so much benefits to having a mythic item Again, number one is visually stunning to have these mythic items and the game Call of Duty Mobile has been out for three years now And they're only 11 currently making this video. They're only 11 mythic items So that shows that goes to show how exclusive and how the exclusivity of having these weapons are just phenomenal because once they're gone they're gone it's a limited time event to collect these mythic items these mythic weapons they do bring them back one time and they bring them back as a redux a redux when it comes back as a redux mean that they brought it back um from a year ago okay so i've never seen a redux redux so a redux has never come back in the second form okay so once the weapon comes out that becomes the weapon and once it actually comes back it comes back as a redux and what i mean by that is um, I'm gonna show you guys right here. So if I go to the there's a redux right now the cross draw redux mythic is right here and This is a mythic that was first introduced into the game before But now it came back as a redux and now is the only time to get it And it's only gonna be here for like another week and a half and then it's gone and once it's gone It's gone forever now. There's another mythic coming out soon shortly the creek six everyone is gonna want that now let's talk about why these weapons are so expensive um and i'm talking about 400 dollars per mythic weapon if you would want it yes i'm talking about united states dollars 400 dollars for one of these weapons now the reason why these weapons are so amazing and so just beautiful and how they're created and so pricey is because number one call of duty mobile is even though it's a free to play game it's a game based on a business model to keep drawing you in 
and keep making money because that's what the business for is to make profits capitalism right so they give you something amazing that to play with and which is a mythic item if you will like and these mythic comes with a whole bunch of benefits of just enjoying the game even further but you do have to come out of pocket heavily if you would like something like this now for me on my channel i go out of my way and i buy these mythic items to be able to share it to you guys and in order to share you have to upgrade it all the way which costs 400 dollars to upgrade it all the way in order to unlock that feature to share it now that share feature is also locked behind a pay system in order to share it now you guys like i'm gonna why would i pay 400 dollars for an item right away if i want a mythic item well the mythic item first draw this is the draw system right here for them for the as val mythic as an example and to get this draw it's about 150 dollars usd to get the draw now you can get the base version of this weapon so if i go into looking at the the val right here i'll show you guys the val right here it goes from level zero to level eight right now i only have it currently at level four and level eight will unlock that share feature now if you want to share the weapon to your friends which is a cool feature in the game you have to pay what's called upgrade materials in order to get that so you're spending another 250 dollars on these mythic cards in order to upgrade your mythic weapon to be fully upgraded in order to share it that unlocks that feature so that's locked behind a pay system now the thing about this is that a lot of content creators will say that you know these weapons are three hundred dollars they could be three hundred dollars um because depending on your luck now i'm not saying that it's not three hundred dollars but i'm going for the very unlucky player because everything is based on a percentage and the percentage of you getting what you want is never gonna happen so i always go for the the lowest the highest percentage of you having to spend all of your money basically to get what you want so in order to the bad luck on this roll to get all of these mythic cards is pretty low. So that means you will have to spend more than the highest you will spend to upgrade your weapon fully is four hundred dollars. So one fifty for the weapon itself, and to upgrade it fully is another two fifty, making it four hundred dollars. So right now this is my overseas account. So this would normally be like fifteen dollars per pull. Now you guys can see my mythic cards that I have right here is let me show you i have 13 15 1315 mythic cards now if i do this draw right here again this is my overseas account so i have on a discount so on my american account this is like 15 dollars just to make this draw and it's going to give me a random draw right here and, I, and you can see how bad my luck is i got 10s and 20s 20s and 10s uh, of the mythic cards now, there's a chance of you getting 50 mythic cards or 80 mythic cards or 40 mythic cards and i got none of those all i got right now this is live by the way all i got was 10s and 20s again you're gonna have to keep spending money in order to upgrade this fully if you would like which is incredibly you know that's their system that they have now me personally i love everything that call of Mo call of duty mobile does um their business practices you know is very you could be questionable to some people but me personally, I had to go out of my way to get a different account, overseas account. So for me, it's not $400. It's actually $160. I think it comes out to $160, $180. Again, it's still pricey for me, but you know, it's a lot less than $400, which allows me to upgrade these and share it with you guys in lobbies and give it to you guys for free so you can actually play with it. And what I mean by that is I get to, sh since I upgrade these weapons all the way i get to sh there's a feature that unlocks called a share feature i get to drop it in a lobby you guys get to play with it for three lives on, and then the next game we play our next round i could drop more copies of it now you guys are like okay joe that's cool but if you want to drop till you go into lobby of five people how can you drop five copies of your weapon for everyone on the team well again that's locked behind of another pay system so what i mean by that is let me go to my loadout and show you so go to the switchblade for example so this is level five and this is upgraded all the way which unlocks a bonus share feature now for example i can share this weapon now you're like jug i want you to drop five copies of this for the entire team how do i do that well since you only got one mythic upgraded you can only drop one copy 
of that mythic you just can't drop six copies of it right away but there's a way you can do it and again that's locked within a pay feature so you would have to upgrade another mythic weapon so i have another mythic weapon here and you guys can see the a is val mythic is only on level four it is not upgraded all the way to level eight where i can be able to share it okay and my game just crashed and let it load back up so as it's loading back up i just want to i'm playing on the ipad by the way i just want to show you guys that you have to upgrade your mythic weapons fully in order to share that amount of copies of that mythic weapon i know this sounds kind of confusing but let me break it down so for example if i have my mythic switchblade upgraded all the way and i have my odin upgraded all the way i can actually share two copies of the odin and share two copies of the switchblade okay so i'm gonna show you guys right here the manta ray black and gold okay cool um i love manta ray she's my favorite character in this game so i do have my mythic switchblade upgraded all the way as you guys can see it says finale final and if i go to my odin if i go to my odin right here you guys can see that i have it upgraded max mythic level as well and this is upgraded all the way so i can share two copies of this and two copies of my switchblade now the creek 6 is coming out next week the mythic version and once i upgrade that all the way because i will upgrade that all the way i will pay the crazy amount of money to upgrade it for you guys so i can share it with my lobbies because i love you guys you know subscribe join my lobby friend me and i will drop it so you guys can play with it for free so you don't have to spend this amount of money i do it for you that's how much i love you guys i go out of pocket everything that i do in this channel is out of pocket i'm not a call of duty mobile sponsor uh, maybe a game sponsorship one day that'll be incredible but everything i do is out of pocket so now you're like okay jug i want to share another mythic i want to share you know the peacekeeper mythic with my friends well because i don't have it upgraded all the way i only have it to level four i cannot share the peacekeeper mythic unless if i upgrade it using the mythic cards all the all the way and that will cost me 1100 upgrade cards i have 14 4, 1400 right now but i'm saving that for the creek 6 mythic that's coming out next week so i can share that for you guys but because i have the switch blade mythic upgraded all the way and the odin mythic upgraded all the way and once i upgrade the creek 6 mythic all the way i can share three copies of the creek 6 mythic so that's how they lock that behind the share feature behind of the mythic card upgrade system as well so hopefully that clarifies what and how the mythic weapons work so why are these weapons so expensive so let's go to let's go to the switchblade for example and i'm going to show you guys what they do and you guys you know make a decision for yourself you can put it in the comment section if you guys think it's worth it and i would tell you got tell you guys some more inside information about what's up so check this out so this mythic switchblade you know it's a it's a mythic skin it's a skin and it comes with these skin attachments as well these mythic attachments for your weapon so you get the mythic skin you get these mythic attachments you get you know charms you know legendary charms you get special kill effects you also get here goes the charm as well oh you really can't see because i can't zoom in it's called a beta 3 um you also get um the special medals so when you actually get kills in the game it pops up it looks visually stunning it's actually phenomenal and you also get a animated border around your calling card and everyone sees this letting you know that you did something amazing in the game when you are on a crazy streak and also you get the trace rounds with this weapon the creek six will have ice trace rounds i'm so excited for that next week and you also get a highlighted kill feed of your name inside of the game on a kill feed so everyone can actually see that you have a mythic item and it looks amazing so it actually amplifies who you are in the lobby to people so it's like an announcement hey this guy you know it's pretty cool because he has this amazing weapon and you also get level five you will get a very special loading icon so everyone gets to see that as well and you get the mvp screen of you holding the weapon as well which is cool and you get to have the share feature now with this weapon you actually get something really cool so all of these people are saying this is why it's pay to win it's because every single mythic item gun has a uh, attachment of a built-in iron sight where you don't need to use an optic so you don't need to use an attachment slot for that item or that mythic which is absolutely incredible but at the same time 
and not having that attachment slots gives you the ability to use different attachments on your gun to make it even more powerful which is so awesome which it should be pay to win because if you're shelling out four hundred dollars you should definitely get a benefit and the iron sights on each of these individual mythics are the best iron sights in the game totally okay which is absolutely incredible so now i so that's basically about it and i'm gonna show you guys what the iron sight looks like in this game of just live of what it looks like on this gun so you can see and you judge for yourself is that a pay to win iron sight yes or no and is it really pay to win or is it just a skin but i actually have call of duty mobile in my dms and i highly suggest to them because they're always looking to make updates to this game big huge updates and i suggested to them that when a weapon is fully maxed out if you're gonna max out a mythic weapon at 400 dollars you should definitely get a stat boost to your weapon because it's not an ordinary weapon at that point in time you know it needs to be something more fulfilling because no matter how rich you are no matter your financial situation four hundred dollars at the end of the day is still four hundred dollars right so the perk right here i actually suggest to them that they should have a mythic perk unlock at the very end once you upgrade your mythic weapon all the way that gives you bonus stats for example it will give you 10 percent more bonus stats for every stat here your base stats so your damage will be 10 percent more your accuracy will be 10 percent more your range will be 10 percent more your fire rate will be 10 percent more your mobility will be 10 percent more your control will be 10 percent more a mythic attachment once you pay 400 dollars to fully upgrade your weapon your base stats should increase and when you put on these extra attachments it should also increase the the power of the weapon yes that's pay to win but you have to realize if you're spending four hundred dollars on a weapon there has to be a super bonus incentive why you should have that weapon you know what i mean and plus you can share it to your friends so they also get to have the feel of that weapon as well again that encourages people to buy and spend money on the game which in turn give them capital money and capitalism but at the same time you want to feel good about a four hundred dollar purchase because it's a car payment you know what i mean it's half of rent it could be rent you know what i mean so you want to feel good or good about it and yes you can destroy in the lobby but this game there's a lot of powerful weapons in this game that could be more powerful than a mythic you know what i mean like sniper rivals are one shot so nevertheless you're still getting an advantage hopefully somewhere so that you can counterbalance that one shot from sniper rifles that one shot from shotguns shotguns are the most op weapons in this game their damage is not even 27 it's like 25 times 11 you know what i mean it's 28 it's like over a thousand damage it's crazy you know for one shot so these mythic weapons should definitely have a boost to counteract that because once you see your shotgunner you know you're gonna automatically die even with a mythic item so there should be an incentive so that you can actually counterbalance that because a lot of people run shotguns in this game and snipers just for the simple fact that they know that they can one shot you so you should have if you're shelling out 400 dollars you should have and some type of advantage or counterbalance to that even more than a regular base weapon in the game if you're spending four hundred dollars on an item so let me show you guys what that looks like right now in game as i load it up and i'm going to invite my friend here blood i haven't seen blood here oh he's actually in a in a lobby right now dang all right that's fine i'm going to start a random game up here so you guys can see i would love to invite blood and show him because he does love my mythic weapon i haven't played with blood like in a month you know what i mean so having him on is really cool to see so him being on live right now i appreciate you blood so thank you I really he loves my mythic white weapons but he will never spend that amount um so you guys can see right here this is pre-match so once i actually start the lobby you guys will see that i will be able to share it and of course these weapons come with a crazy animation inspect which is pretty cool as well to make you feel good about your purchase so we're gonna start up a lobby here and now you guys can see it says share so I get to share two copies of that since I have two mythic upgrades. So I can share it and drop it for my friends. And that is it right there on the ground. And no one's really paying attention to me because I dropped it well too late. They just concentrated about the objective, which they should be. And that is how it works right there. So hopefully you guys understand what a mythic weapon is now. What I suggested to call them mobile, mobile devs. And you guys let me know. Is that, a, is that a, oh, someone just picked it up. <laughs> Dang, two people just picked it up. They just grabbed it and run. Okay, that's cool. And, and that's how it's done you know what i mean you want to be able to give back somehow as a content creator and this is a beautiful way so your viewers can you know experience something really super expensive and have total amounts of fun in call of duty as well and this is what i do for you guys i come straight out of pocket and pay this crazy expense so you guys can have fun in this game as well so until next time let me know in the comment section how you feel about this treat yourself i'm gonna treat you don't cheat yourself until next time i'm jug love you guys to the fullest and i'll see you here for another one
Peace. Have a good day. I'm out. Love you. People that just go let the credits roll. Hey! I am the walker of sky. My name is Eternal. I will never die. I will go down as one of the greats. One of the ones that everyone hates. If it's the fame or if it's the infamy, I will get up to the top of the industry. This is my story and I am the author. The story of Skywalker.